Today, we're gonna be driving about eight hours for a cup of coffee. About four or five years ago, our little brother, well, this is my, this is our big brother, my older brother, I'm, I'm the middle. I'm standing downhill right now. I'm, I'm the little brother, but our, our, our little brother picked up and moved to Tennessee. And then last year, last winter, he ended up quitting his job and starting his own coffee shop. We haven't seen the little guy in a year, year and a half. So we're going to surprise him. We're just going to drive eight hours and go have a cup of coffee and hang out with our little brother. Why not? I mean, we have a long drive. Let's go. Yeah, you, you can talk. What were you going to say? You know? say he's, he's been giving us shit for not coming over to visit him. <laughs> you moved away. Like, like, we didn't move. Like we don't have you other moved. shit to do. We got families. We got jobs. We got houses that are always breaking and shit. <laughs> you moved. Yeah. This is your fault. <laughs> So we're driving eight hours for coffee. We're not driving eight hours without coffee, that's for sure. That we're not driving there for our first coffee. Um, I'll be drinking coffee the whole time. <laughs> I think that's just gonna be a theme. We're gonna be. I don't think we're gonna sleep for three days. I think it's gonna be good. Uh, Java for days. Yeah. Coffee liqueur at night. It's gonna be great. <laughs> it's gonna be one caffeinated time. <laughs> One thing is, you know, Kurt, like we just realized we got the same coffee mug here, so we're gonna be like sucking on each other's freaking yeah, drinks. You stay on your side. Oh, you'd be so lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Got to cross the Potomac into Virginia. Sucks it's all foggy. It's beautiful. I love crossing this river. Long rocks. Big river. It's still beautiful. It's actually really beautiful. I take it all back. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Hey, Kurt, I'll tell you a little secret. They're down there. Yeah? The fish are down there. No. We're driving over them to go to Tennessee. There's Harper's Ferry up there. It's pretty good. It's actually kind of cool with the fog. There's Virginia. Virginia. It's for lovers. For lovers. Apparently we've got a bang on our brakes Smash. now. Mm -hmm. I see mountains are right here. <laughs> We're in the hills there. Coming close up there on West Virginia. Too bad our cousins aren't with us. <laughs> Welcome to West Virginia. Welcome to West Virginia. West Virginia. Yeah. What? Yes, sir. There she is. Oh my gosh, we're in West Virginia. Wild and wonderful West Virginia. That was quick. <laughs> we're flying gonna, through these states, bro. We're gonna be back in Virginia for <laughs> another eight hours. Six hours. What's that? What's that peak over there? It's like Maryland Heights or something like that. That's where Eric and Bree actually got engaged. Yeah. Then he left us. He don't even send us any cheap whiskey. Why are we going to see him again? <laughs> We're making a stop about halfway through Virginia. Kurt's yeah. got to take a PB. Lexington, Lexington, Virginia. We're going to check out the local fair. We're hanging out at the, the Palms, the little, little, little corner bar, I guess. What you got there, bro? That looks amazing. A southern specialty right here. It's basically a chicken, chicken and waffle, waffle sandwich. This, this is like syrup that's got hot peppers in it. Yeah? Yes. I'm, I'm lame, I just got some, some wings. I messed up. Dang, low carb. Look at all them carbs. I want some of them carbs, bro. Let's sneak a carb in there. <laughs> got him. Yeah, so lunch was delicious. His thing looked absolutely amazing. Oh, I love that. Um, yeah, the palms. Yeah, the palms. Cool little spot. And where are we at? Lexington? Mm -hmm. well, I guess our, our next stop is going to be Tennessee here. Just let it go. Okay. Don't walk. Oh, well. Sorry. I'm not from around here. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. Old Dotson, baby. That's a beauty. Why is it raining? Raining. <laughs> We're almost to the Tennessee line. And I'm bored because I've been sitting in the car for about six hours. So I'm scrolling through, looking through Facebook and stuff, you know. And I come across a post that said, you know, it's like National Sibling Day. And I'm like, bro, is it National Sibling Day? I look it up and it's 
April 10th is National Siblings Day. And it just so happens to be the day we decided to like surprise our bro. I mean, <laughs> I was like, what are the chances? He's like, one in 365. <laughs> I'm like, bro. I'm like, this is weird. It's weird. It's meant to be, little bro. Come and get you. Better watch out. You don't know what you're in for. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, baby, that's the one right there. Woohoo! We did it. We made it. Oh, there's a Bass Pro shop right here, bro. Bass Pro. Forget air. Forget it. Damn right. <laughs> so we made it to Tennessee. Now we got to figure out how we want to do this. And we were thinking like maybe ordering like curbside. Maybe he comes out, and if he doesn't come out, we'll complain about the coffee and ask for a manager so he comes out. Or we just go in there. We're thinking about doing disguises, like wearing like wigs and stuff, but. A little too obvious. I thought about just running in and be like, where's the bathroom? I gotta take a dump. <laughs> but I don't know. We're but just... he'd, know, he'd know it's us like right then and there. So we can't do that. We gotta be a little more just kind of so sneaky about it. are we it. going in together or separate? That's I the... still think we should probably go in, in together. Miles, just kind of nonchalant. Just look at the menu. Just kind of, you know, stand in line. I'm, I'm gonna walk right up there and order my coffee and just see what happens go sit down obviously we're gonna be wearing masks so i don't know we'll yeah, see how so long it takes takes them to, to figure it out now, and now your point a little high and there's also there's also the option that he's not there and his wife brianna is and at that point we'll start to find out where he is see if we can have her call him and bring him in or you know something neither one of them might be there for whatever reason they're just some employees might be around the joint so um, maybe we'll get them in on the act, but we'll see how it plays out. I think we're just going to wait to find out. Just going to wing it and just walk right in there and order some coffee and see what happens. There's a coffee sign. Yep, there it is. Black sign right there. I don't see Eric's car. I don't see Bree's car either. <laughs> He's not parking around the corner. Oh, there they are, they're right oh, there. Shit, right there. They're right there. They're right there. No, that's not them. Is it them? Sure, I think it is. Pretty sure that it is. It doesn't look like them. Pretty sure it is. It doesn't look That's like definitely them. Eric's. It's got a Virginia tag. It looks like his car, though. Oh, my though. goodness, dude. It, it, the little girl inside looked like Bree. I know. Isn't that crazy? I don't think it is. <laughs> <laughs> So, oh. <laughs> there it is. So, um, I think I'm just gonna walk in with my phone by my side and hopefully I capture the moment, as they say. I definitely wanna see those people going in. They might come to close, to close it, to, I don't know. Here we go, let's do it. We made it this far, let's go. You notice, notice this pretty, sorry, pretty early. <laughs> Guess I still need to order some coffee. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? How are you? Oh, oh my goodness! You gotta knock me over. You see that little man? What's up, beauty? <laughs> How are you, Sasa? 
Jeff? You so big. You so big, you see Uncle Max? Go get him. Can I get a hug too? Can oh. I get a hug? What are you guys Can I get a hug? Cold brew? Black? Yeah. What are you guys doing here? We, we were gonna go to the Outer Banks and we were like... I took a wrong turn. Yeah. Now <laughs> <laughs> you come and come to your weekend. Oh. What the hell is that? The big, get the big. <laughs> I had no idea you were gonna... Well, we, we've been trying to do this for a while. Uh -huh. Planning to do it. And we just so happened to be today. <laughs> On our way here, he's scrolling through Facebook. It's National Siblings Day. <laughs> really? I'm like, dude, and I'm like, I looked it up, and it's like 410. Our area code. I'm so confused. <laughs> You're confused. I'm so confused. My little brother's got long hair. He looks like a hippie. Thanks. <laughs> oh. Dude, the place looks awesome. I hope you don't have anything planned for tomorrow because your plans are getting changed. Oh, <laughs> man. Or either that or we're tagging along. Yay! Um, Yay! We just drove eight hours for coffee. <laughs> Might as well try it, right? Well worth the drive. How was that? We just drove eight hours to have coffee with John Stamos. <laughs> John Stamos. That's why you are. Oh, goodness. It's delicious. Cool. Good. You want to talk about your place? You care if I make this into a YouTube video? No, I don't care. Well, it's the next day, and uh, we caught up and had a great time last night, and we wanted to show off the coffee house. Hi! <laughs> um, Awkward! <laughs> my name's Eric, I'm Kurt's brother. This is my wife. I'm Brianna, Brianna, and we are the owners of Stillwater's Coffee House. This is our shop. As you can see, um, we are located in Gray, Tennessee, which is... Just Perry, outside of Johnson City, Just Tennessee. Just outside Johnson City, East Tennessee. <clears throat> and yeah, we opened January 11th of 2020. Great timing. Yeah. Wonderful timing. <laughs> Crazy about time. a month and a month and a half before. We, we call it Fran's luck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that wasn't in the business plan. That's for sure. So we uh, we actually live in Gray. Uh, we live only about five minutes from the coffee house. Uh, most of which, uh, before we open, we have a lot of fast food and things like that. But nothing that really brought the community together. So we uh, we've actually always wanted to open a coffee house. Or it's always kind of been a what, back of the back of the mind dream or never thought like it would actually happen. So we spent a lot of our first yeah. dates and things at coffee houses, mm -hmm. drinking white mochas. <laughs> <laughs> back when we liked things a little bit sweeter, which yeah. now we like it not as sweet. But yeah, we wanted to create a spot where the community could come together and rest and get away from the busyness that everything is. It's just everyone fills their schedules constantly. It's like everyone feels lazy if they're not doing something all the time. What our slogan is actually value rest, which is just a reminder to place rest as a priority in our lives because we have so much, we're connected so much in, in the world. We're connected by our devices and all these things all the time, but we never, we, we've kind of lost the sense of authentic connection with other human beings. and. We want to remind people that you know it's a very important thing to prioritize in their life if you want to not burn out or things like that. Family place, family owned. You even have a little kids corner over here and in, in the other other side of the wall. We've always believed that if we're going to bring the community together, that includes the little ones, and they're not a distraction from more important things, but they are the most important things. Our kids are are always here and uh, running around, love it here. giving everybody a. Everybody if you're ever in East Tennessee, come check out Stillwater's Coffee House. You're not going to get a discount. Hook my brother up, leave a fat tip. And thank you guys for watching. God bless. <laughs> oh, snap. Chris got a fish on here. Nice bass. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Look at that honk. <laughs> Tennessee, baby. First Tennessee bass. Nice little Tennessee bass right there for sure. It's a fatty. The old stink out works every time.
<laughs> it's a nice fish. Beautiful. Thanks, buddy. My turn. Whew. He was healthy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn.